welcome back to my channel so today i am looking at the cybex pre and buggy so i'm going to unbox it for you we're going to get it out we're going to have a look at it and then i'll take it out and about here there and everywhere and we will see how good it is i think i will unbox the frame first this is the frame and the tricking wheels apparently this wheel the bad boy and I believe they are not um, air filled, they are foam filled, so you're not going to get punctures in these, which is always great. That's one big one. Two little ones. Another big one. This, I believe, is probably the underpass, I guess. And then the frame, and I think these are two adapters. So everything was packaged up really well, nice and safe, and everything looks pretty great. So I've had a little read of the preamp frame manual, and we're just gonna pop it all together. It looks very, very simple, so I have high hopes that I'm gonna do this really quickly. Okay. secure it onto the actual frame all very easy and then these bits let's go there's two little clips at the bottom as well that just clip on like that and yeah that's nice and easy what's great as well is it's got this magnetic thing that you can like shut it or open it so clever and that's the frame all set up so that was pretty quick and pretty easy I've just noticed you've got your arm thing there, the safety thing, so when you're pushing it, if you let go or something, it's still attached to you, which is always good. We do like a safety feature. In terms of the handlebars going up and down, it's really easy. It's just pushing one button up and down. Very easy. Oh, I find the brake, I suppose. Right in the middle, just there. That's a good brake. In terms of folding it up and down, it's really easy. There's two buttons here, one on the top and one on there on the handlebars. So you slide one across, press one down, and put the handlebars all the way down to there. And then if you're wanting to just kind of just store it somewhere standing up or whatever, you just literally put it in like that. And it's like quite secure, just sitting like that. Or if you want to do it completely flat, you just make sure it goes like that. And then there is a little bit of elastic in the middle of the um, undercarry basket thing that you pull around from underneath and you just attach it on and that makes it completely secure like this, which is great for going in your boot, obviously. As you can see, it goes really, really flat, which is wonderful, especially in um, some boots. I've got really big boots, so I'm all right, but some boots that are smaller, you need as much space as you can get. So folding as flat as possible is always a good thing. So I'll flip it back out. It's just a case of pushing it down like that. And then, yep, yeah, the thing's there for the handlebars to come back up. And now everything is locked and secure. So like I said before, it's just the one button underneath that's up and down, that's as low as it can go, and that's as high as it can go, so you can be quite quite a tall person with this buggy, which is great. And now let's get the seat part out. I love how on the box it says, congrats, it's a pream, <laughs> as if it's your baby. So in here you get your little manual, and then the actual seat, which is nicely packaged up. We'll take it down here. There's your hood part there, brain cover, handlebar, and then the actual seat unit itself. I've just folded it out a little bit and I'm going to pop it onto the frame. It's literally as simple as that. How easy with that? The handlebar things, I'm going to pop them down, so I'm going to pop them like that and then just slot this in. And I believe. There we go. And I'm going to put the hood on, which has these sort of clip bits here, which go into a gap just on the frame there. There's also a gap at the back of the hood, which will let you have access to the bit that makes the seat go up and down. And that's the seat all set up. So that was nice and easy. I know, do you like the buggy? I like it. You're gonna lie down, are you? Yeah. 
Thanks. And I push you? Yeah. Oh, okay. The branding on the product looks really good. There's all sorts of bits and bobs that say Cybex, but it's not too in your face. This is the bit I was talking about earlier that has the magnetic parts. You can have it like that, or you can just flip it back up. The seat itself is really nice and padded. This all feels really lovely, and it's quite easy to get in about to access the straps at the back and things like that. In terms of the straps, it's basically this bit here you have where the two straps go into, so nice and easy. They just clip together and clip in. You can adjust the straps easily using that, and then this bit on the padded, section clips over there to make it nice and comfortable for your child. There's none of this faffing trying to get the two clips in together before you clip it in as well. You just put one in and then the other one in and they're easily adjustable with these bits here. The wheels when in this mode can turn around but if you want to lock them you just literally pop this down and they're locked. The seat is really easy to move up and down it's just with this lever here that you pull down like that and it can go to fully flat mode. Or it's easy to pull back up into any position really. There you go. The seat can easily be reversed, you just pop it out like that. And turn it around. What's good as well is these buttons are memory buttons, you pop them in and it remembers you film it so you don't have to hold on to pull it out. So I've popped them both in and now I can just pull the thing off. So much easier and the handlebar makes it all very easy. The footrest part is easily adjustable as well. It's got buttons you just press down and then move it to however you want it to be, whatever height you're looking for. Also with this um, seat unit, it is at high chair height, so it's great for if you're on about eating, you can wheel it in to a table if you had it facing around the other way and it'd be a little high chair for you. The handlebar comes off really easy as well and it's great because it's one of those ones that rotates and things. I have a couple of buggies where it's one of those static ones you have to take both bits out and it's just really annoying whereas this you can have it like that to get them out and then just uh, pop it back in. So it's so much easier than like I said some of the other buggies I have. The sun canopy is great, it's really structured so it feels nice and sturdy, you can pull it up and down. It's got the zip to make it into an XXL one, which comes all the way down to there, which is great. But you also have the flat part here, so you can look in or let them have a bit more air. This is actually the Luke seat that we have, which means it is suitable from birth to 17 kilos approximately, which is about four years, I think. But the difference between this seat and their two-in-one seat is the two-in-one seat is just suitable from six months, but this one, like I said, is birth. And this one also has the comfortable seat inlay, which is this right here, which is super comfy. Balancing on a weary line Too scared to trust you and jump down I'll keep my status quo up here Won't let anybody come near I'll fix it on my own A bit sunny, a bit tired 29 years I've been the same Trying so hard to run from shame But how long can I keep up the pace To fool myself I don't need grace we really, really like the Cybex Supreme. It is so easy to maneuver, it's so light, it's really clever with all its functions. I think my favorite functions are the memory mode button things that take the seat on and off, because that's just so clever and I've never seen that before. Um, also the fact it can fall down so flat, that's really good as well. And then the magnetic bit on the huge big basket, those are probably my three favorite things about it. The fact it can be used from birth is great as well with the seat we had. Um, Alakman was super comfortable all the way down in it, which was great. And yeah, we've just really enjoyed testing it and using it. I think it'll be one of our favorite ones. The husband really liked it. He feels like it's a really manly pram and he really enjoyed pushing it. It has a really nice wide handlebar thing for you to push so that probably added to the manliness. But all in all, we've really, really enjoyed it. So we would recommend it if you are in the market for that kind of travel system. It can also come with a carry cot, um, the other seat I mentioned, and then also it has the adapters for putting a car seat on as well. So kind of an all singing, all dancing travel system for you. But thank you so much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed this and we'll see you very soon. Bye.